Bill Robertson of San Pedro, Neighbors for Peace and Justice, introduces Standing Up and Speaking Truth to Power, their annual 4th of July event on Liberty Hill in San Pedro, California. Hello, workers. We're here at Liberty Hill for our annual unpermitted <laughs> gathering, rally. Uh, so I see uh, a lot of my fellow workers here. All right, that's great, that's great. Uh, we got a great program today. Our title is Standing Up and Speaking Truth to Power. In 1923, the Marine Transport Workers Un Industrial Union, uh, number 510, it was a branch of the Industrial Workers of the World, and I'm getting that right this time, the IWW, also known as the Wobblies, called a strike that immobilized the entire waterfront and 90 ships here in San Pedro. The union protested low wages. <laughs> That's, uh, what, 90 years ago? Uh, and <laughs> one of our issues today. Uh, bad working conditions uh, and the the imprisonment of union activists under California's criminal syndicalism law. So, denied access to public property, strikers and their supporters rallied here at what was then a hill and they called the site Liberty Hill. Upton Sinclair a famous writer of the time, who was also then running for governor of California, was invited to speak to the workers of the world assembled. He got arrested under the criminal syndicalism law while reading the Bill of Rights. He got into the First Amendment and some uh, LAPD officers picked him up at directly at the mayor's uh, request and imprisoned him. The entire event uh, helped uh, mobilize the uh, strike, uh, got public opinion uh, on the side of the strikers, and eventually, but it took another 10 years, uh, we organized the waterfront. So we celebrate that we can be here today in peace and freedom, and uh, uh, just to be sure, we're gonna read the Bill of Rights. We got a great program today. Our title is Standing Up and Speaking Truth to Power. And our keynote speaker is Joe Galliani, who's wearing his Troublemakers Union t-shirt. And if you haven't caught him before, uh, he appears, he pops up at city council, at the uh, Port of LA, and just about any government agency that has anything to do with continuing to pollute our planet. And James Allen will, will perform his ballot of Liberty Hill. He gets a new stanza in every year. Back in 1923, there was a waterfront strike. Down in Pedro, there was a struggle and strife. Just off of Beacon Street, where the lumber was hauled. The Wobblies were co-opted at a place they called Fink Hall. 